it's been a long time <laughs> i feel like i'm always saying this but it's been a month or two since i last posted but life has been chaotic as usual and i'm back in portugal i'm finally free from my assignments from uni really because i handed in my final project on wednesday yesterday basically um and yeah i haven't been reading at all i have been focusing on uni and obviously i got a new kitten and it's been a challenge to do the adaptation between cookie and bella because bella is very territorial um and she's got trust issues it's been two weeks since i arrived here from england and uh, they already stay home alone without cookie being locked in my room so that's successful and they do play and bella sometimes gets annoyed which means she hisses at him or slaps him but it's not with her claws anymore so it's just like a little slap like let let me be leave me alone um and that's okay i've watched it a lot and she's not hurting him i think she figured that he's a kitten and therefore he's very sensitive and vulnerable but yeah we're still going through it a little bit he sleeps in my bed which is nice i do love to fall asleep with purring in the background so it's very it's it's so cute it's too cute for me <laughs> i'm in love but yeah as you can see i've had my first two sunburns and the first one was in portugal no the first one was in england which really surprised me because i went to a park um, in Derby and I was there with a friend and with my French teacher and we were just hanging out it wasn't sunny it was cloudy so I think that made it worse because when I got home I took off my glasses and as you can see my nose is completely toasted <laughs> but yeah that's that's what happens um, when you don't put sunscreen on in the morning and I just remember that I forgot to put it on today as well which kind of sucks because today we're going to Lisbon's book fair I was not very excited at first which is weird because I usually am but my boyfriend was like no you have to go you go every year you've got to go you got to go and then a friend of mine invited me to go so we're all going together i'm currently at Rui's practice now and they'll be joining us soon and they'll leave their car here and we'll go in our car together let's just get on with this day and i'll probably update you at the end of it we'll see how it goes but i think i'm just going to read i brought my kovo um my reader with me and i'm currently reading pole position uh which is an arc i received uh this is by rebecca j caffrey uh but yeah i'm enjoying it so far i'm at 12 percent it's a Formula One gay romance from what I've gathered. And yeah, the I, I know it's very small here in my uh, screen, but I really like the cover. I figure like it's so well done. But 
yeah that's what i'll be reading until whose practice is over and then our friends will be here soon so <laughs> If you hear any weird noises, is my baby kitten, Cookie. He's playing with um, <laughs> he's playing with a flower. But it's been a couple of days, and I was supposed to um, I was supposed to record in the same day, but. I couldn't because it was too warm so I ended up not filming a lot in Lisbon's book fair it was too warm for me I ended up uh, getting out of there with a really bad headache but yeah um, I got some books I was not expecting that and that is because I didn't have a list or anything like that I was just going for the vibe but then my boyfriend kept saying like you should buy one or two that's okay like why don't you and I don't know I was feeling a little bit off and I think that's because of uni basically um, but yeah I'm gonna show you which books I got So, the first book I got is, I think, the fourth book of The Witcher and I've been getting them slowly because of the dust jackets because the interior isn't the serious one but yeah, this one is the Portuguese version but I don't mind at all. I do enjoy The Witcher and I really need to rewatch it, really. But yeah, this was the first victim. <laughs> and now the second and third books are by Kender Blake and I bought these ones um, because they were in like a separate box so it was six euro each as you can see and they're they're new so yeah I'm pretty happy with this uh, I think there are three books so I just need to get the last one but yeah it's still pretty nice the the spines match and they make like a little crown here but yeah I'm excited to read this and then I got a romance, a historical romance book so this is by Janine Cummins and I don't really know lots of it but a person that I know read it and she was loving it so here she is um, yeah. so it's here and we'll see how it goes I I don't have many goals for this year but one of them is to read more historical fiction and I don't know I guess I've been reading it's not bad, but I've been reading too many TikTok or book talk uh, recommendations and my favorite genre has been a bit MIA, but I think that's also because I've been with uni work 
and I need to be able to focus on the story and need something a little bit more fast paced I, th I think but last book was from Kara Hunter I think this one was uh, no this I, I I thought this was one of the books of the day, but it wasn't. Um, I think this is the first book of the new series. And because I've been enjoying it, like I've been enjoying thrillers so much that I just couldn't help myself. I've never read anything from Kara Hunter, but I'm very excited. Um, I've heard lots of things, good things about her but yeah it. I think like I picked it up and I saw like how it was set and it's not like only text text, it's got like message um, messages and stuff like that, I think it's even got like schemes and it's very exciting. I do love when books have like a different structure because it really adds to the reading environment. It's really nice. I do need to take the stickers out because I, when I was there I tried to pick something up that didn't have stickers but all of them had. So um, yeah, I need to try and take it of my book but yeah let me show you my new pile I do need to make room for them in my shelves but that's a problem for another day <laughs> but yeah they look cute together um, I'm very pleased with how different they all are and yeah let's see how how this goes and they're fighting <laughs> but yeah I hope you enjoyed today's video and um, if you liked it please subscribe and comment down below which book is your favorite or which genre is your favorite and I'll see you in my next video bye